crafted another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. This Watch other out. time. Oh. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Giggle McD, and today, today, my friends, as you guys can see on the screen, we're going to be playing The Walking Dead. I think, I, I'm pretty sure I cut it down a little better, but we're going to make it work. So I saw this game on my Microsoft store, and I'm like, am I, do I want to play Walking Dead? But I, at the same time, I do watch the actual show, and I think I might enjoy this, so that's why I decided to download it and make a video for you guys. I better hit that like and subscribe button and then share the video. Okay? Okay. Alrighty. Tall Tale Games presents. I always say Tall Tale is Tell Tales. In association with Skybound Entertainment. The Walking Dead. It would be, fun. It would be nice if they had like a voice in the background that said The Walking Dead in like a dark, creepy voice. Episode 1 A New Day. So this part takes place before the whole zombie out the zombie outbreak. Oh. Shoot. Always the black dude in the rest of like, bro, what do you do this time? I, I like I gotta say I like the animation and quality. I like the style. I like actually, let me rephrase that, I like the style of the game. It gives me more like a um it gives me more of like a um well, Comic like I reckon you didn't do it then. Um, you know what they say about reckoning. I didn't. I don't. But I reckon it's a lot like assuming. Yeah, something like that. I have no idea. What no, I've driven a bunch of fellas me. down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually, it's about now I get the I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. All right. Science is an option. Silence. I'm not gonna talk to him. Always stay quiet. Mm, but you don't talk too much, do you? Wait. Wait, what? I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. What do you think? I'm just glad I chose law and not order. Big mess of trial like that. Even if I am so confused. A lot of what happened can't ever be undone. Is that a shotgun? Did we take that? Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? No, it's no choice. Much choice. Sure don't. <laughs> Silent treatment. Hold up. So regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Me personally, I'm about to blow your brains out if we talk bad about my wife. Oh, I, I meant to. <sighs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna see the zombie apocalypse is starting right now because the helicopter is there. And they like, you know, out of there. So, let's look at the rearview mirror. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over Dang. right where you're all sitting. Are available for incoming to one Bro. Then before long, Listen he starts that, kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property. And I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Um, I got. For, I want to know what he did. did. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. 
He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. What? This guy must be on, this guy has to be on something for you. Dude. Like, how are you going to sit here and like, uh, kill someone? And then after that, you just say, oh, was it me? It was a misunderstanding. Like, what? It goes to show. People will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. That's true. Though. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. This Watch other out. time. Oh. <laughs> I'm really going. What the heck? The man dead. Also, that hit though. I'd, t I'd say that he did swerve to the side, but still, like... Get your look, get your stuff out, boys. Get your stuff out, boys. Get your stuff out, boys. I got myself fully loaded, too. But dang, no, that was like a bad car accident. And he survived that, too? Dead though, so like, did he crawl? Wait, what's oh? Is that oh? What shot the hell did he have his gun out? Maybe it was tossed from the car during the wreck. Nah, boy, he was trying to defend himself, hey. but that didn't work out. Hey, officer, are you all right? I'm still cut back here. You can clearly see the man is laying down dead. Like, how are you gonna act? That's stupid, officer. That doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. Damn it. Okay, what's, what's this? Oh, okay. Press it open. Press it open. There you go. I need to drag myself out that window. Bro, do it then. Don't just say it. Drag myself out that window. Oh, I gotta move. Okay. I haven't played a uh, Telltale game in a long time. Uh, the last one I played was Minecraft Story Mode, and that was like a while ago. Oh, wonder why the crash was so nasty. Let's uh, Oh, okay. Alright, so let's go over there. Take the keys, take his ammo, take his gun, and get the freak up out of here. Can you take the gun? The officer's shotgun is over there. Yeah, pick it up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Looks empty. Ah. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Okay, I'm gonna say at least hold it on you for like weapons or anything. This for a weapon. I say you shooting, it gives like half a gun like this. Let's uh, walk up to the bloody corpse. And look at this. Look at this. Officer, uh, look at the cop. I'm looking at him. God damn. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, the keys are right there. Let's take that. And we just. Oh, there we go. Do it like that. It may seem like something was like coming up behind me, bro. That's not a bad scare tactic, though. Oh, we got, oh, we got to get the other one. Officer. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Get away from me! Where your bullet? All right, one, one. All it takes is one bullet. Where are you? What the Wait. fuck are you? Ooh. Where's the all? It... <laughs> what? 
bro. Reload and pop. Don't make me do this. Ah, still a beast, though, baby. What? Okay, so while I'm in a situation, I think in this is the trigger button because normally in all shooter games you push this for the trigger, but no, A is the trigger button. Hmm, that's new. All right, we'll put that guy. Got to put him down. Yeah. Bro, be a man and pick the gun up and keep going. Shit. What the hell is this? Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! <laughs> oh, my, 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 my. oh, we got some walkers. Oh, no. ah. All right. ah. How are you? At least they can't, at least, at least they can't run though, so I ain't too, like, it should be easy to survive with the zombie popping, because all the, all the zombies just walk, they don't run. So that's that one zombie movie with the Will Smith, like, those zombies be like, hey, he ain't living. Unless you're wounded, then you kind of screwed, but if you like, you ain't good, uh, they shouldn't be good. Tracks uh, and zombies too, like big noise, like uh, gunfires. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I like I like oh, the I like the style of the game. Anybody. It gives me like that, like I said earlier, it gives me like that comic vibe. It, the game is 3D, but at the same time has a little has a little bit of 2D in it. Look a little faster. I know your leg is kind of jacked up, but we gotta we gotta keep going. Come on, walk faster. There you go. Hello, anybody home? I need a little help. You just like break. Hello. There's break. something going on. Wait, we like break it. Hold up, let's uh. Oh. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Let's walk in. Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Not an intruder, you just like barged in. These people might need more help than I do. It's back there. This man is slipping and tripping like, bro, like, stay focused, man. Any, uh, bullets? Any shotgun and stuff? This place has been ransacked. Just about anything worthwhile is gone. Hmm. A walkie-talkie would be nice. Oh, right, let's hold on. Okay, we got the inventory, so any bullets? No. no. What's this? Oh no, we're not messing with that. I'm not messing with that. I remember I watched this one episode of um Walking Dead. Um they uh I forgot what episode it's was season. Deep. I forgot what episode season it was, but I remember they affected the water supply, causing half of the um community to like turn. Like, dude, it's... Mm, the Marshalls. That's a Savannah area code. But that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. Right, let's there are three new messages. Oh, there we go, right here. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. 
Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two. Oh, okay, okay, so i never seen any gameplay footage of the season one of Walking Dead, but I did see gameplay footage of, like, I believe season three and four, but Clementine is the one that this character looks after, and I believe the girl we saw, shut up, I believe the girl we saw, like, in the woods is Clementine, I think, because she's the only one that'll be wearing a hat. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. I like an emotional attachment to it. Huh? Uh, they be having you have emotional attachment to characters. Hello? I know. You need to be quiet. I'm guessing that's Clementine. Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Who? I'm not gonna ask that. How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm, uh, 37. 37. Okay. <laughs> 37. Hello? Did they get you? I I'm sorry. I'm here. I don't want to ask them. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. High ground. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. The high ground. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, it's not even loaded. Oh. <laughs> Say, like the second time you. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. <laughs> Not done? You done? Double tap. Oh. <sighs> Ooh, though. Man. Did you kill it? Nah, nah, I, I healed it. I think something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Two nights ago? Yeah, that's probably what happened. You've been all by yourself through this? Wait. Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. 
you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Um, so... What should we do now? Let's keep looking for this. Uh, let's get up the... We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're yeah. less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with our parents are gone. That sounds good. Just, but we can hide in my tree it's house until then. Tell a kid that though, so it's like It'll be a tough climb with this leg. I see why he's kind of dodging. It's like oh, it might be a while. I see why he's doing that. But Let's like, go. It's not Stay easy to tell to a kid that. But dang, no. Uh, I do. Uh, I should chose the other choice. Ain't no way we. Uh, that was stupid on my part. Now let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. It'll be okay. Stay near me, and we'll move as fast as we can. Hey, don't shoot me, here, bro. Oh, then she run. Oh, she uh, she going? Oh, she probably like taking cover just in case. All right. So basically, to sum everything up, uh. Our character. I found the bastard. Are we going to die? <laughs> uh, I don't know. No, I'm sorry. I, I, uh, I probably should have said that. I should have said no. We're not. Stay down, Georgia State Patrol. Dude, he won't listen to that. We're friendly. There's a little girl here. Shit, you're not one of those things. Neither of us are. Bruh. We really oh, talked. Damn, you've got a little girl. We're sorry about that. Well, Andre's sorry about that. <laughs> it's Officer Mitchell. My name's Sean. Sean Green. This is Andre. Officer Mitchell. Did you see any of those things? One of them just got our buddy Chet. I just saw a girl inside that house. Nah, it wasn't him. Oh shit, you hurt your leg pretty bad. Yeah. Look, help us find the thing that got our buddy, and we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's farm There's for safety. He should be able to fix your leg up too. There's I'm zombie. not a dad. I'm a babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Whoever you are, let's get a move on. We just were. Oh shit! It's Chad! Let's go! Get to my car! Yeah, he missed out too much donuts. Bro. Pull the trigger, man. Relative friend. You gotta you can't, you can't, you can't this off. Unless they cure him, I guess, then they can let him live, but like. You can't let him live. You got. You got it. Pull the trigger. I've been running for like 20 minutes now. Ooh, a farm too. Okay. Say hi to your dad. Yeah. I'm sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. You can't keep Take care of the mouse. I'll swallow one though. Pine control is not bad, but I want to see you keep a mouse with every place. Kept out of Thank way. God you're okay. I was like, wearing a big bad here, too. Walking dead quiet as usual the past couple days. We're breaking down the way things his mare has gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of Atlanta, and, uh, Chet, he got killed. No, you're kidding. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You brought a couple guests. Uh, we, uh, need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. 
Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. What type of question is that? Do you know this man? Yeah. If I was it's white, you wouldn't have said anything, wouldn't you? I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could be worse. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. I'm going to say, I don't know. <laughs> How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Uh, home. home. Where's home? I grew up in Macon. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. Nobody. Is that so? Yeah. It is. You said we. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. But what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. Ooh. Oh, but it's oh, but say. It smells like shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. Shouldn't oh. talk like that. That was a swear. Very <laughs> yeah, nice one. I just... missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. It's getting dicey. Dang, have a sleep. <laughs> Get up. Mm. What an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Where do parents name their kids Duck? We're from Fort Lauderdale. We were on our way back before things up and went bananas. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? More than Mary. Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! <laughs> Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Let me get to know the character real quick. Hey there, girls. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? 
I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, first yeah. grade is always easy. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Alright, let's get to work. The first grader. Interesting. Right, what's this? It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Okay. So, what do we have to do? Oh, okay, we must go looking at check out over there real quick. Dead right. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. 